You know what? Whoever just said ice go miss in in the chat, whoever just said ice go miss in the chat, you're on thin ice, buddy. All right. So, what are we doing today? Today we're gonna be trying out ba ba bomb Galarian Slowking. So this team was sent to me by Gray. Now Gray says a rain ish snow ish team that works in Trick Room and Tailwind, and it features Galarian Slowking and Glacier. Also, the Speed IV on Glacier is just because I couldn't find anything better, but I guess it outspeeds zero Speed IV Amoongus outside of Trick Room. So that's pretty cool. Uh, paste is right here. Code is, you know, on screen right now. But let's go ahead and rent that thing and we'll we'll check it out. The team seems... I mean, like, the spreads are fairly basic, but I think it could be fun. I'm not sure what anything does, but I do want to try this out on stream because I haven't used Galarian Slowking yet in, like, any videos. So I don't even think in Sword and Shield I used it, but let's go ahead and check it out. Also, someone asked me the other day. Well, they asked me two things. They said, Mar Marcos boosted. Um, how do I send you a team? And you do it by sending it to me on my Smogon profile in my uh, on, on my wall. Like you see all the other teams sent. Make sure you send the code and the pace so I know what the team's, you know, built like. Um, but beyond that, someone also asked, Marcos boosted, Mr. Boosted. Marcos, Yeah. Uh, do you build your own teams ever? And I and I had to say, yeah, it's just been a minute. I'm tired. <laughs> I'm tired. Well, look, I'm going to try to enter a tournament sometime soon. I'll use the team I've been cooking and then we'll make it a rental. But yeah, let's go and try it out. Like I said, this team spread seemed very basic. A lot of 252, 252 going on. But honestly, even with all that, it's like we can deal with it. Like if, if it's 252, 252, I know what to expect. My Rillaboom's fake out's going to go slower than a lot of things. And... Yeah, I think that's that's my only gripe. Rillaboom's fake out's always gonna go second versus other Rillabooms, but we'll live with it. Let's try it out. I thought Mr. Boosted was your father. Unfortunately, no, Mr. Boosted is not my father. I'm my own dad. Alright. I'm Mr. Boosted Jr. And yeah, if anyone in stream wants to drop a team on my Smogon profile, I'll link you guys it right now. I'd appreciate it because, you know, we usually use two teams per stream, one per video, but two per stream. So if you guys want to send me a team, um, I don't, there's not a lot like super interesting on there right now. There's like some cool stuff, but there's nothing like as cool as like Galarian Slowking, which is why we're starting with that. So if you have anything heat, anything I haven't used yet, I'd appreciate you uh, sharing it there. Some details as well as like what the spreads do would also be helpful. All right. That is Iron Treads, and I have not seen that like ever. Um, I believe under Trick Room, we have a really nice matchup here. Um, yeah, I should be able to Trick Room pretty easily. Let me check this really quick. I like Disable on the Slow King. I'm pretty sure I saw that. Yeah. Disable on Slow King is pretty cool, uh, as well as Eerie Spell, because if you don't know how Eerie Spell works, Eerie Spell lowers the PP of a move um, whenever you hit something. So, like, Pokemon like Urshifu Rabbit Strike that have eight Surging Strikes, they're only going to have so many left after this. Let me actually check something. Eerie Spell. How much does it decrease it by three? I only have 48 seconds. You guys are probably screaming at me like, what are you doing? Yeah, so Eerie Spell, if they Surging Strikes you and then you Eerie Spell... They're down to half of their moves, and then they, if they get Eerie Spelled again, they lose it. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and lead off with the guy. With the guy. They do have a fake out user. I don't know how much I care. Actually, do I want to lead off with... If I'm going to expect, like, Iron Hands on lead, I think I should lead off with, like, Rillaboom. We'll bring the Glacier in the Heatran, and I think we should be good there. All right, and I got the spreads right here. Terra Rock on the Rillaboom is a little bit interesting. I don't know what that's meant to do. I guess you resist flying. I think that's specifically what it's for. And you don't you don't have any fire weaknesses. Yeah, and you're not weak to ground, or at least specifically earthquakes. That's kind of cool. Eh, Terra Rock's not bad. Terra Rock's not bad at all. All right. So with that in mind, um. I should always Trick Room here. Oh, I really hope you're not Scarf Final Gambit. You might be Scarf Final Gambit, just looking at how your team works. Uh, do I predict the Scarf Final Gambit? I think I need to. Can 
Let's go Heatran. And I think I just want to go for the Wood Hammer. I don't mind losing Heatran. I, I mind losing my Slow King, though, because that's kind of what I need to win. I'm just predicting it. Last time I tried to predict Scar Final Gambit, I was wrong. I'm just going to hope I'm right. Yep, there we go. Cool. Nice. Icy Wind? I'll take it, man. I'm slow. Oh, wait. That did a lot. Hello? Oh, it just dawned on me. We're not AV. We're Miracle Seed. Well, I mean, that's still chunks. I'll take it. <laughs> you know what? That's that's good, too. That's good, too. All right. Um, I might need to tear a rock here. It depends. We'll see. I'm going to go into my Slow King. Moltres, the Pokemon. Yeah, we're going to have to tear a Dark. And I think I am just going to U-turn out of here. Yeah, well, Trick Room, eh, I should, I should tear a dark Trick Room. Yeah. And we will, oh, we don't have U-turn, hello? I don't want to go for the hard switch either. I guess we just go for the knockoff, okay. I'm, I'm hoping they just go for like, okay, well. All right, some notes. I will say a note for this team is AV Rillaboom would help out quite a bit. I know you don't have access to it because Glacier has AV, but it, it would be worth looking into switching that item or at the very least throwing like U-turn somewhere in the Rillaboom. It's pretty useful. Okay, cool. I don't mind losing that too much. Because I think a double up into this Iron Hand should do it with like Stomping Tantrum um, plus Eerie Spell. That might be enough. I'm not certain. I think I should always just uh, protect here though. Because I think they want to fake out my, my Glacier. Oh wait, I'm AV. I'm an idiot. Okay, well... None of that for me. Yeah, I don't think we're getting this dub. Withdrawing the Iron Hands? Okay. Well, probably going to be... Yeah, Tornadus. Do we have any special attack investment? We do not. I don't know if this Eerie spell is going to KO. It does. Okay. They go for foul play. Interesting. Um, I can disable that. Or do I want to just go for chili reception? I think I get more out of chili reception. Yeah, I'll chili reception and I'll try to ice school crash. I'll probably get faked out, but we'll just see how it goes. Probably gonna Terra on the um on the Moltres. The way they switched with that Iron Hands instead of going for fake out though, they might be Swords Dance? Oh, they're Terra Dark, okay. That's not great. Well we do have close combat. Maybe we'll be able to pull something off here. Wait, did I miss I I completely misclicked. Or no, I guess it doesn't matter. Wait. No, I'm an idiot. Okay, it did it did work. I was I was concerned because I was like, wait, that's not the move I want to click. It was. It was the move I want to click. I'm just an idiot. Green punch. Oh, that does too much. <laughs> I was because I was expecting Snowscape to come out for some reason. That's not the move I clicked. Let's disable that, and I am just gonna go for uh, close combat. I literally just brain farted there, dude. I brain farted. Yeah, he tells a joke so bad that it snows. You know, 
as as it does <laughs> as it does when you tell a bad joke all right hopefully they just drain punch again and then i might be able to win because we're, we're snowballing now we're not we're not only balling we're snowballing Can you drain punch? Can you drain punch for me real quick? He swords danced. Okay. All right, buddy. All right, buddy. That's terrifying. Too bad I win. <laughs> Too bad I win. We're good. Yeah, that was that was kind of a scary game. Uh, that's definitely on me though, just like not recognizing the move set that I had, like an idiot. Even though it's right in front of me, it's it's the issue I have with open team sheets, where I'll like not read my opponent's open team sheet and do something stupid. But this time it's my sheet and I'm not reading it. Still got the dub though. Still got the dub though. But I was right. Yeah, the way that they didn't click fake out was basically just like yeah, their swords dance. Also, the foul play makes me think that the AV was on the Moltres. Because you don't typically carry foul play on Moltres unless it's like AV or something. Is Galarian Slow King's whole thing just being annoying? I think so. I think so. Yes, Masterful Gambit, Mr. Boosted. Yes. Me clicking the wrong move. Masterful Gambit, Mr. Boosted. <laughs> I got like a hair from my head on my nose. And it's not hair from the nose part of my head. <laughs> All right. Um, that was a stupid joke. That was a stupid, dumb joke. Dumb, stupid, dumb. Um, I mean, Slowking goes kind of crazy into Dondozo, doesn't it? Doesn't it go a little bit stupid mode? Doesn't it go Insano style? Doesn't it go wacky, wacky doodah mode? Um, or Terra Bug on the E-Tran. Which kind of shocks, wish I was Terra Ground, or Terra, Terra Grass here. I think I'm going to lead off with Rillaboom. I don't know how good Glacier is going to be. I, I get a lot of value out of like Heatran, right? You know, we'll go Glacier. We'll go Glacier. I believe in him. You might not believe in him. I believe in him. You've donned your last Dozo. I hope they have. I will say, whenever I'm using my own teams, I don't typically lose to Don Dozo. When I use other people's teams, I find it much more difficult to beat Don Dozo. We'll see what I can pull off here. Hmm. We're not AV, but we are Terra Rock. I think I want to go into Heatran. Do I Terra Rock Woodhammer? I'm doing it. <laughs> I'm doing it. Just finished the Ice Cube video and you started streaming been liking the amount of content we've had. I appreciate it. I work very hard. <laughs> I work really hard. All right, be like Terra Ghost. Terra Fire, that's terrifying. Terra firing. Um, luckily, if they go for Heat Wave and they faked out into the Galar Slow King, I'm not in like the worst spot ever. No, I, I've donned my last Dozo. And I'm poisoned. Okay, great. 
and I'm gonna get close combated. Oh, please dodge, Rillaboom. Please dodge. Nope, he's gone. Well, he's probably fine, but he's, he's gonna be gone. Yeah, yeah, it's, that's. I think my opponent's about to click the most obvious close combat of their life. Would it be worth protecting this turn, or should I just go for it? I think I need to protect this turn. Just try to get Slow King on the field. I'll just Wood Hammer, sure. Might be able to identify an item too. Close combat, yep. Do you know what inspired the Terra Rock? I, I'm not certain, but I would hazard to guess that it's just like, you know into a lot of matchups you're that into a lot of things that Rillaboom is weak to you know ground types earthquake you don't care about because they have grassy terrain you can also defend against ground types with like wood hammer um fire types you're concerned about you resist fire now flying specifically i would hazard to guess is the the main reason all right galarian slow king here has 156 special defense. If he does not live this, I am suing. I am just suing. I'm gonna click Heat Wave and Trick Room. That's a lawsuit, bro. That's a lawsuit on my opponent's hands. Or that, that's a lawsuit on my uh <laughs> on on the the renter the rental team maker's hands. All right, can you please live? Okay, so no, all right, <laughs> yeah, it's over. It's over. Um, I, I guess it's not completely over. It depends. I might be able to counter sweep, but only if like grassy terrain goes before burn. But that's the only way. Okay. Like I said, grassy terrain going before burn. That's that's the only way we're winning this. Stomping Tantrum. I could also Stomping Tantrum and Disable. Because I don't know if Eerie Spell would KO. I could also totally double them, but I'm too scared to do that. I'll Disable because I'm pretty sure that's Specs. Actually, no. It's times four. Eerie Spell is going to KO. My only concern is to whether or not they're... um. A good item. You know what? I am gonna double it. I'm tired of second guessing myself. I am doubling you. Because if it's Sash. Yeah, alright. Well, I just need to dodge now and we're like good. I just, I just need to dodge. I was right. It is Sash, but I was kind of hoping that it wasn't because that was my only win con. Alright, double Heat Wave dodge. Double Heat Wave dodge, or at least a Heat Wave dodge in the Glacier. That'd be cool. We are slow back. Yeah. No, we're getting... No, it's it's over. No. Genuinely. Genuinely, though. Why did our Heatran get one shot by close combat? What is this thing's attack stat? Because I feel like most Heatrans can, like, tank a close combat. It's got really good bulk. Let me look at this. Heatran. It's got 106 defense. Uh, Sneasler. 130 attack. Yeah, I guess it's a little much. Okay. I am adamant that most Heatran should be able to eat that, though. However, if the Sneasler was also adamant, that's where the issues come in. <laughs> Alright. Is this Will Tank? I always face Will Tank when I'm streaming. This has got to be Will Tank. All right. All right, Will Tank. This thing's zero speed, right? Yeah, that's zero speed. How do I get this off more reliably? I 
I definitely think Trick Room is my play here. I just don't know how I go about getting it off. Hmm. I think we just go for it. Let's try it. I really want to like this team. There are just a few things that are kind of making me not like it too much. I think specifically it's got to be some of the Terra choices. Only really two of them though. I think just Heatran and Rillaboom. Okay, this is fine. I always get my Trick Room off. Alright. Taunt the Slow King. Thank you. Poggers, in fact. Poggers? All right, that's pretty good. Um, I can now chilly reception. Mm, I might just want to double up this iron hands to be honest. Eerie spell would do a lot and I don't think I ever lose my slow king this turn. Yeah, let's double it. Maybe I should have knocked off, but who knows. AV? Definitely AV. Oh, okay. Drain Punch. I can disable that next turn. And that's Miracle Seed, bro. That's insane. Yeah, there's no need to disable. No need to disable. We're in this. We are officially in this. Fairly certain Iron Hands is always going to be within range of this uh, Icicle Crash. Yeah, that should be within Icicle Crash range. Um, let's Eerie Spell Bleak Wind Storm. I just have to not miss this, right? See, I don't want to go for Stomping Tantrum because they can like... What can they do? Yeah, I don't want a Stomping Tantrum because they can, like, Terra Grass and live. Ice Cream Crash is a little bit of a risk, but I'm willing to go for it. Alright, can you, like, send in Urshifu? That'd be so cool. Chen Pao? Alright, nice. That's fine. You know what? Whoever just said Ice Cream Miss in, in the chat... Whoever just said Ice School Miss in the chat, you're on thin ice, buddy. Whoever just said Ice School Miss is on thin ice. <laughs> Alright, well, I don't even know how I do this anymore. Disable that, go Heatran. Hoping for a Sucker Punch. I think it would be fine if I wasn't Terra Bug on this Heatran, to be honest.
Terra bug is getting more and more questionable. I think this is the second Terra bug Heatran I've been past. Hmm. Please burn. I'm Terra Darking just in case their throat chop. That did nothing. Oh my god. We're done. Can I like burn? Is too much. I like need to burn bad. Oh my god. Whoever said heat miss in the chat, same person on thin ice. And I, I died a sucker punch now. Well, I mean, that's just it, isn't it? Because if I just get sucker punched, I, I like drop and then I lose. Sacred Sword, yeah. Can I like get a burn? Burn, 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 burn. Where's that chatter when I need a burn? Yeah, I mean, just judging by, like, what's... All right, here's what I'm going to say. I could have Stomping Tantrumed. I personally think I made the right choice in going for the Ice Go Crash. Personally, I believe I made the right choice there. In case they wanted to call it out and go for the Terra Grass. However, if whatever's in the back is named Fluttermane, I just would have won that turn. Yep, there it is. Yeah, I would have just won that turn. That sucks, man. All right. Well, that's about it. I don't think I'm going to use this team anymore. I will say it's a fun team, right? I think Galarian Slowking is fun. I think it paired with Glacier is very cool. Um, the team can be optimized for sure. I mean, like, U-turn on Rillaboom would be really useful. I don't think uh, AV is the right call on Glacier for this team. And, like, a lot of the EV spreads are pretty just, eh. But overall, it was a fun team. I got kind of unlucky that last game to lose the, the match, but it is what it is. Uh, if you guys enjoyed, you know, and you're watching on YouTube, leave a like, subscribe, turn notifications, and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.